Welcome to another tutorial on setting up a theme by StudioPress. My name is Jan and I'm a restart strategist blogging at jcock.me and this video will be about setting up the front page of the modern portfolio theme that's developed by StudioPress and that's based on the Genesis framework. To demonstrate this setup I'm using the website artofberta.com. Berta is an abstract painter and a friend of mine. She's living in Germany currently and she wants to present her art in a new and beautiful way. If you're interested in art in abstract paintings, definitely check out the, her site. So when we go into it and we go to all pages, we can see or we will see when the page is loaded that there is no home page. There's just an about and contact page. And what that means is that we have to search for another way to configure the home page. Actually, this is within the widgets, and in the widgets you can see four widget areas titled Home About, Home Portfolio, Home Services, and Home Blog, and this is where the contents of the home page go. The Home About page, uh, the Home About widget, is this black, black background with white text. This is great to welcome new users to your site, and to add this text, it is pretty simple. You just need to add a text widget and enter the contents that you'd like to have. So that's pretty easy to do. When we come to the portfolio, let me show you how it looks. This is the portfolio area. It's titled paintings in this case because she's advertising her paintings. And those are blog posts from a certain category. As you can see here in the portfolio sections, there is a widget called Genesis Featured Posts and this is how you have to configure it. The title is the title that's displayed on the home page. Here you can select the category, in this case it's painting and we have six posts to show because this theme is presenting three posts in a row so you want to have a multiple of three here. We ordered it by date. Um, yeah, we don't show an author gravatar, but we show the featured image in the portfolio size. And that you can basically copy those con those settings to your site. What's important is, in my eyes, to show the category archive link, which is titled more paintings for our website, so that people can take a look on other work of you as well. So we already have covered the first two items of the home page, the black text, which is the home about feature, the home about widget, and the paintings, which is the home portfolio widget. And as you can see here, we have another black part, black, black background with white text and a button on this side. And this one is a bit tricky because this, this one, as you can see here, is in the home services. This again is a text widget, but you have to use some HTML to align the text to the left and the button to the right and to, to style the button. As you can see here, we have a div that's an HTML tag and the class is align left. That class comes with WordPress. You don't need to code anything. You can just copy this text, then enter the content that you want to have aligned to the left and close the div by copying this text. And we do the same for the right aligned button, div class align right in this case. And to create the button, we need an H and an A tag that again is an HTML file and an HTML tag. You can set the class to button, which causes the um, link to style accordingly. href is where the link refers to. So in this case, we'll link to con our contact page. And then you can have the value of the button and close the div of course. You can just copy this whole paragraph and then customize it as you like. The last feature that we are not using in our case is the blog area. So you can display the, la the latest blog posts on the website. And you do that by adding the recent post widget to the widget area called home-blog. And there you can give a title like recent posts 
and select the number of posts to show and this would make the home page to display the, the latest blog posts. Yeah, that's it for configuring the modern portfolio theme, just as you can see here on this page. If you like the theme and if you want to do me a favor, you can go to jcock.me slash modern portfolio, which gives me a bit of affiliate commission at no extra charge for you. Thank you very much if you use this affiliate link and if you enjoyed this tutorial, please share a comment below so that I can, I can see that you enjoyed it. Thanks.